14 points. And all it took was three bills that I was already paying on time. Ya tres juguetes nuevos, mamá. Let me see. Let's see. Play, monkey, play. When you crave the uncomfortable. Oh, no. <laughs> what are you looking at, dude? You're watching TV? Are you watching TV? I'm so sleepy. I'm so tired too. I said I'm so tired and sleepy. I better not be pregnant. That's a question. No, I'm serious, dude. I am. I'm really tired. I'll be back. I wasn't going to go job today, but if I don't go today, where is my AirPod? If I don't go today, I'm going to procrastinate. I'm not going to go tomorrow, and then I don't have time to waste. So I'm going to go job. I took off my sweater because it was like leaking. The sweat was leaking out of my jacket. So I took it off. Now I have to do my workout. And I'm done. Oh, thank God I went to go draw because I would have been mad all freaking day. <sighs> Look at my fake abs. I'm done with my workouts. Oh, thank God I worked out today because otherwise I would have been so mad all day. <sighs> it feels great when I'm done. Now I'm just in the shower and change. Oh no, I need to find my other AirPod. I lost it. I lost this one a week ago. Then I found it and now I lost the other pair so I don't have to find it. So. I almost tripped on that freaking pumpkin and I had to put it in the middle. Like I was the one who put it there. Mrs. Whiskerson. Brielle says she wants that cat, dude. She says she wants that cat. Ooh, que bonito se mira, wow. Ah, es que no tiene calor. I dice que andale a la maquinera. Le dice que ándale a hacer esto. No, 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 all my earrings. I think I'm missing some. Am I? No, I'm not. Sure. Wait, make sure you carry my hamster. Put him on the floor. You can put him there so he can roll on the ball. Okay. Where were you, Jason? <laughs> Jason. I you look really ugly, dude. Really yes. ugly. The phone too. <laughs> Marcus starts to see him. Jason, dude, what is he wearing? Remember his pajamas? He was like with his legs open and they had a hole. <laughs> and, and decorate it. Yeah? And then, like, Your mom made me a really big pancake. But it looks so good. It's so fluffy. And then she cut up little strawberries for me. Mm -hmm. Wow. Wait, let me see. Maybe I want to add. Does the whipped cream taste good on the pancakes? Yeah. Okay, I'm just going to put a little bit because this is so much sugar for me. Yeah. You finished all your food? Cool. Hey, take that back. Take that over there. You guys, she slept for like two hours straight. Like you can tell on her eyes that she had a really good nap. I left, um, I put this blanket on top of her and then my comforter and I left that sound on, um, I called it Pandora, it's from her swing and then I also left the candle here so it was like very very warm, she was all comfortable sleeping, how baby? Estabas dormida mamas? You barely woke up from your nap? Yeah? Was it a good nap? <laughs> it was a good nap mamas? 
Yeah, she was, huh? Look, yeah, that's how you can tell it's a really good app. How come her forehead is more red than usual? I don't know. Okay, come on, let's go. Well, she was falling asleep. I think she just gets distracted because of the phone. Oh, there you go, look. She's still tired, but she can't go to sleep yet because it's barely going to be 8. You go to sleep at 10.30. You have a mess until 10.30. <laughs> You're so tired, huh? Is it because it's winter? You're tired because it's winter? See? So my sister made me like the biggest pancake on earth and I'm like super full. I didn't finish it. And then I also made myself a nice coffee. It was on my little glass cup so it wasn't like a lot but I'm like really full. And then today I didn't do nothing at all. No homework, no studying, no workout, nothing. So tomorrow's going to be a very busy day. Since it's super cold outside, it's like literally gloomy out there. I'll show you guys right now. Um, I am turning on this candle. It's the Vanilla Bean Oil. It smells like vanilla. <laughs> um, there we go. I don't know why that thing's going crazy. But I'm going to set it right here. <coughs> and the kids are watching this cartoon. I'm not sure what this is, but... The baby's right there. This is Genesis. Genesis, your feet should not be on the couch. And Jason's over there eating cereal. Um, their mom went to pick up. I don't know what, but yeah, this is me. Don't mind the carpet. They're gonna install it very soon. But this is our view, like always. I showed you guys this on prior um vlogs. I don't know if I should work out, cause look, there's nobody on the park going. I couldn't go jog today, obviously, because I'm babysitting. So I don't know if I should work out or if I should just relax. But then again, I don't have time to relax, so I might just work out. I was gonna go work out, but um, apparently I'm not anymore because my sister left the kids with me. Well, I picked them up from school and then, well, I have my daughter. My sister is my babysitter, so she's not here. I don't have a babysitter. Oh yeah, I'm gonna go jog. And it's really, really cold outside. I came out here just to like show you guys how it looks. Um, but it's super, super cold. And then I don't know why my nephew's backpack's out here. Let me tell him to get it. Jason, Jason, can you please come get your backpack? You left it outside. This is what I deal with. Look, I tell him something, he doesn't listen. Watch. He listens, but does not leave her to his freaking PS whatever the hell he's playing with alone. Watch. Jason, the backpack is right behind you. What? Why is it yours? Well, you tell me it's yours. Wow, you're so beautiful. Say goodnight to everybody. You're going to go to sleep already. Say goodnight. How come you look so white, dude? Let me see. I think it's like it's not focusing. Say good night. Good night. <laughs> All right, let's go to sleep. It's time to go to sleep. I think it's about to be like eleven or something. Ew. All right, let's change your diaper, okay? Let's go to sleep. I mean, hold on. First, you gotta comb your hair to go to sleep. You can look pretty when you wake up. You can look more pretty when you wake up, okay? Okay, pues. A ver si tú también así me peinas cuando yo esté viejita. Okay, me vas a cuidar tú, okay? Tú me vas a cuidar. Yeah. Also, go jog with me, but I can't yeah. take them to where I jog because it's really dangerous for little, little kids. Where are the keys? The keys aren't even in here. Okay, can you get my bag, please? Yeah. I'm looking for the car keys because... I always this lose them. Bag, right? Yeah. It's heavy, right? Yes. I'm getting ready to go to our because it's already kind of late. So I'm gonna like warm up. 
Well, I went wait for my friend because she's gonna bring me some earrings. So hopefully she gets here on time. We're tired. I don't want to go today, but I didn't go on Tuesday, which was yesterday or Monday, the day before yesterday. So I have to go today. Unfortunately, wait, wait, and it sucks having to work out without energy like that. It's the worst. Your leg like this <laughs> and then you have to stretch like this okay and then you pull push your leg back this one on the back push it all the way back <laughs> good <laughs> oh my then god i can't believe you stretch it with me huh you have to run yeah and then you go running Which block do you want to jog around? Uh, that one. Alright, tie your shoe. Huh? Here, let me tie it. Hold my phone. Okay. Alright, Jason, are you ready? Are you ready? Yes. I don't know why he wants to jog with me. I just got home from jogging for miles. Now I gotta go jog again. I guess. Woo! Hey, come here. What this called a uh, dandelion or dandelion or whatever to make a wish. Okay. I wish. I'm not gonna say my wish. There, I made my wish. What did you wish for? Oh, you can't tell me. Did you make a wish? Yeah. All right, Harry, we're going to jog. Come on. Come on. You're tired? What? Well, sleep. Baby, you're so cute, my love. Oi, wait. Dude, Genesis. I almost tripped on your backpack. I'm gonna write my baby a letter. But I don't know what stickers to use. I have a lot. Um, um, I just got up and I feel a little congested. Like, I feel like I'm getting sick. By the way, this is what they don't tell you about parenting. If you're sick, what do you do to, like, not get your baby sick if you're, like, the one that watches the baby? Like, I have to wear this mask. I'm, like, I'm gonna change her. And she's been sneezing, so I don't want her to get sick. So I have to cover my mouth so that I don't get her sick. Because if any of my saliva touches her, then she can get sick. And I'm not gonna give her any medicine. That's just how I am. Even if she's old enough to get medicine or drink medicine, I'm not gonna give it to her. I don't believe in medicine, and I don't think we need it. So, um, yeah, I, I, the best thing to do is to keep her healthy. So I have to wear a mask. Are you happy? Are you happy, Jim? You're happy? A ver, show me that you're happy. <laughs> I just finished, finished jogging. I'm gonna talk. I'm only gonna go today because I feel really sick, but I have to. I'm just gonna stretch and do my workouts inside and then I'm done turned these light bulbs off because like they're a little too bright even on like the slightest um what is this sound on the lowest um setting they're still super bright so i had to turn them off because maybe you like won't see with those on um let me go to wipe to wipe that because i felt like it was a little bit dirty but um i put her on her swing i changed her i um feeding her again and I think that she cries a lot because um like usually she doesn't cry but right now she's been crying a little bit more because since she's already getting a little bit older and then she knows who her mom is now um she gets like a little sad when she doesn't see me literally like I'm not joking she has to see me because otherwise she like starts to cry so I just got off the phone with my boss let me turn this shit off um so uh so i got two job um positions or offers whatever two jobs 
at um the prison and i did take the first job because i was like oh well you know i was all excited i was like yes i got a job um so i took that one and then i got a call from the boss for another job position in the same location and um he's like how would you like to work for us and i was like mm, this is actually the job i wanted the you know the second job offer that i got but because i had already took the first one i was like what should i do because you know it's gonna look wrong on my end to just if i already accepted the first job and then now i'm like well never mind i'm gonna say you know accept the second one um well long story short i ended up going with the second job offer and um the reason being is because the first job offer they have had me fill that fill out this form and pretty much they want me to be vaccinated and honestly i am not willing to get vaccinated COVID 19 vaccine for no job there's no way you're gonna get me to get vaccinated unless it's like do or die um so i said that to the to this you know to the boss for the second job offering that i had and i was like to be very honest i already accepted a job position but um they want me to have the vaccine and honestly i'm not willing to get it and he's like okay well i don't have it so you don't need it you can just test every you know every week to twice a week i think he said and um you know you don't need to get it and i was like okay so since he let me know and he told me that because it's up to the boss pretty much so since he's the boss and he told me that i don't have to get it then i don't have to get it but for this other job i still had to fill out the form and then have i had to submit it and then get them to review it and um wait for a response back so i was like you know what i'm just gonna go with the second job because it's like you know like it's like set stone <clears throat> pretty much so i went on with that job position and right now i was filling out my forms and i called the boss of my boss and we went through my application and everything said now i just gotta get a tb tuberculosis to tuberculosis test and i gotta make sure that everything's good with that and if everything's good then i should um be ready to start working soon i submitted all my files my forums they're gonna do a life scan and um i'm excited i'm really really excited because like it's boring not doing nothing at home plus like i have i need a state job it's like i need it well it's not a requirement for my career but i do want it because it would look great on a resume so um because it's a state job you know it's you can it's tough to get a state job because you have to have like a very very i'd say well no criminal history because you know i am gonna work at a prison facility so it's like it's, it's a huge deal for them to be like very honest responsible and trustworthy so yeah um let me get my baby also the state benefits are like they're good they're not the best i'd say um i mean they're they're there <laughs> uh but yeah i'm excited i don't know when i'll start working supposedly for this first job offer that i had i was gonna start working on monday which is three days away but because i turned it down i'm not gonna wait i'm now waiting to see what my start date is for this other job and i'm honestly really happy because he gave me like a lot of um feed not feedback but just information regarding the job and the job um you know like where i'm gonna work who i'm gonna work with and all of that stuff and it's great like he said my office is gonna be in his office so he's my boss i'm being there he said that i will be his right hand so that's great um i guess it's only four people in this specific department and then headquarters is in sacramento so i will only be um what's it called so i will only be what's that word I always forget words let me see if i can remember because i always forget words okay so i'm gonna be reporting just to him and um he reports to his bosses which are in sacramento um and he yeah like i said it's only four of us it's three of them now and then it would be four with me and i like that because honestly i don't like you know like this is what i was telling some you know someone earlier today I hate working with women because women love drama. They love to be in like, you know, cheese mess arguments and stuff like that. And honestly, I'm not about the li that life. I hate that. And it's just, it's ridiculous. Like if they have your name here and there and they're like, you, you know, ella dijo esto or 
esa persona dijo que tú, you know, like I hate that. I don't like to be in stupid comadre chismes or enredos, if you know what I mean. Um, so the people that I'm going to be working with, I'm going to assume it's the people that interviewed me and they're all older than me. So I'm like excited if it's, it is them because I'm not willing to like look stupid because of someone else who has like bitter or drama issues with me. You know, like if they're all bitter and stuff and they just want to fight for no damn reason and make me look bad or have me like in cheese back and forth, I'm not going to go there. So I rather just avoid it in general. Plus, like at Wonderful where I was working at, like the company I was working for last year, they have like everybody there is all about cheese and it sucks because like it shouldn't be that way. But anyway, um, I think I'm going to end the vlog here. I don't want to make this longer than it already is, but um, I will update you guys in on anything on my next vlog and uh yeah thank you very much for watching here's brielle i don't know if she wants to say bye do you want to say bye do you want to say bye <laughs> i'm gonna assume that's bye um uh yeah so i will see you guys on the next one and thank you very much for everybody who has been subscribing i truly truly appreciate it i promise i'm not even saying this just because like i truly appreciate it so i know my baby does too although she doesn't really know much about this Bye. Say bye. Okay, guys. Bye.